Hey guys, how you doing today? It's me, Kelly. This is going to be a very quick video sped through. Not sure if you guys are really interested in this. However, I told you uh, in the other video, in one of my last videos, about making, I don't know, kind of uh, positive energy, positive vibe kind of uh, pieces that I want to send out to people. Um, you know, just to send some love and to have as a kind of like a good talisman in a sense. Um, so here what I'm doing is I took the uh, Mod Podgeable glass domes, you get six in a package, and I painted with the licorice in folk art paint, acrylic paint, um, kind of like a line down the center. Um, I'm practicing. This is just something I had in my head that I wanted to do. Um, next time I probably will uh, tape it off so I could get a better... Um, I don't know, better middle, but I like the handmade look of it, um, you know, so we'll see. But to, I'm using my normal thing that I use to clean it up is just water on a paintbrush with my acrylic paint. And I do that and I kind of clean it up a little bit. I wanted it a little thinner. Obviously I got paint all over my hands and cleaning it up and just with regular water and cleaning that glass up and drying it, obviously. And I'm just so in love with the way this came out. I can't stand it. Um, but yeah, so I want to make a whole mess of different, you know, kind of things. Now, could you have used a round circle in the middle of this? Yes, and I will be doing that as well. This was just, I wanted to see if I should use black marker or if I should use black paint. When I used the black Sharpie, it did not, um, which I tested out prior, it did not work. It did not get as dark and opaque as I wanted. Um... Now, you know, I use my black marker for everything. I need to get new Sharpies. So it could be that it just wasn't dark or juicy enough. But use whatever, you know, whatever you want. You don't want to use black? Don't use black. Um, yeah, so you see I'm just kind of just kind of playing around and, and looking at it right side up. These are the dome, the domed ones. And you can use glass beads as well. And they're upside down. So the dome is on the bottom part. I got the flat part. That's what I'm painting on. And I am using the delicious Folk Art Extreme glitter in Peridot. And you put on as many coats of you as you want of this. I probably did, I mean, you can see the lighter, you know, that kind of thing. Um, which I think once it dried and you put black on the back, it probably would have looked gorgeous. But I did, I think I did three, four coats of this. I blew it dry, let it dry, another coat. And I try to go both ways. Like the one time I'll go the you know, up and down, the other time I'll go sideways with it just to cover. Um, and I do it fairly thick um, when I put it on. And, you know, you just kind of let it dry. And look how gorgeous it is. Now I'm going to just paint some regular uh, folk art licorice on the back, the black paint. And it just makes it look a little more, I take it around the sides of it as well. I don't know, it just adds a little more to me. kind of makes it look more finished. Let me know if you guys like this. I love doing it. Let me see if you guys do it. Um, as always, please be kind to each other. You never know what battle somebody else is fighting. Leave me a thumbs up if you like what I do. I appreciate it. Bye, guys.